Hi guys, uh, some, bringing you a bit, uh, something a bit different uh, today. Uh, decided to uh, show you the Orc project I'm currently working on. So uh, this is an Assault on Blackreach Orc Warboss. Let's zoom the camera in a little bit and then get it to focus, which is another mission entirely. There we go. Uh, an Assault on Blackreach Warboss that a mate gave me, uh, pre-built and pre-sprayed, and I just had a bit of a bash with it. Um, using tin bits and lead belcher for the um, for the metal parts, uh, washing it with agrax. Uh, trying a bit of a different orc skin scheme with this one, so uh, gone for I think it was Castellan green, uh, Thonian camo shade, and then up through the kind of yellowish green um, layers. Um, different colours like Bane blade brown and Mechanica standard for the uh, trousers, and then highlighted up, and then corn red. Uh, and, and Mephiston red uh, along with uh, some Runefang silver to do a bit of chipping um, but yeah the, the first orcs I've done in years really um, I'm, I'm really into the story of uh, Rin's world uh, for those of you who don't know it's the Crimson Fists who get their home world invaded um, and uh, yeah I was uh, they, they, they kind of struggling to take on these orcs so I ended up playing a Crimson Fist player not long ago called Jack who uh, really inspired me into the whole orc uh, kind of side of things now uh, at the big Warhammer World game for the video for it um, I had a chat with Flash Terra Zero One and we both decided to kind of do a project alongside each other now he wanted to do Blood Angels so rather than Rin's World we've gone for Armageddon um, so I'm doing a Speed Freaks army, as hence the red, um, and he's going to do the Blood Angels. So this is Warboss Akadaka of the um, the Akadaka Speed Freak clan. Um, there is on a complete random tangent, guys. Um, it's the first time I've used the Games Workshop texture uh, paint, so it comes out quite cool. Let's see if we can zoom in on that a little bit. I wasn't too keen on it to start with, but it allows you to build up layers you aren't able to do with sand very easily. So things like mud, getting different textures rather than just that pretty much standard lumpy grain surface. It gives you something a, a bit different each time, which I kind of like. Uh, I've broken it up with some of the greener workshop tufts. And yeah, it's come out all right. I mean, I'm quite pleased with him. I'm going to be doing, as I say, a slow build. So I've got 10 orcs just here now i do believe the orc boy should be lighter than orc war bosses and orc knobs so that's the orc boy that's the orc knob so not quite as uh, dark but getting there um i'm doing the orc boys and the orc knob 10 of them all together uh, in a truck and that's gonna be my first unit I think Flash Terror has done uh, Captain and some Terminators for, uh, first. And I'm just kind of building an army and seeing where I go. I mean, if I enjoy it, I enjoy it. If I don't, I don't and I'll drop it. But I like this model. Uh, it's come out quite nicely and the boys seem to be doing all right as well. So I'll bring you another video when they're done. Um, cheers for watching. Bit, a bit of a random tangent, bit of how my mind works for Orcs. Got to be honest, guys, I love Orcs. Uh, the way they play in game, just a bit mad. My only gripe with them is you spend hours painting a model and then it dies pretty much instantly to a bolt gun. So I have to see how I do. Hopefully, Speed Freak Time is going to be a little bit more resilient. So, yep, yeah, cheers for watching. Um, any feedback for me, that'd be very much appreciated. But hopefully, you'll see, be seeing some more of Akadaka and I'll bring some battle reports for when we start doing some of this. I might even approach the local gaming club. I, I don't know if any of the gaming club members watch this. If, it's the, uh, if uh, they do, hello. This may be the first time you've heard of this because I've not really talked about it uh, to anyone. I'm just kind of spitballing ideas at the moment. I don't know. Um, but I might see if I can get a campaign mapped Armageddon campaign going on give me an excuse to really do these and get other people involved as well but we'll see literally random thought that i might go down on there and have a chat with them so um yeah that's my at war boss cheers for watching guys i'll stop rambling now and i'll speak to you later cheers bye, -bye.